Hello, today I'm going to be showing you how to restart a Windows 7 computer. First, what you're going to want to do is take the mouse, which you see right there, and hit the Windows Start button in the, in the bottom left corner. Then come over to here and you'll see something that says shut down, log off, restart, something like that. You're going to want to hit the arrow, or just scroll over it, and then hit the restart button. And then your computer will start restarting for you. As you can see, it says it is shutting down, which is the first part of restarting. Restarting is a two-step process, basically. Uh, first, it shuts down, and then it starts back up. Sometimes there might be a third process where it does updates before it shuts down, but if it is, it would normally do it automatically uh, from the Windows operating system itself then. And now, as you can see, it's starting back up. Restarting your computer can be useful because if you have newly installed programs, they might not be functional until you've restarted your computer. Or even existing programs that have recently updated might not work with the, pro with the update properly until your computer has restarted. So now that your computer is turned on, you can log in just like normal with all your updates and whatnot working fine. Some computers may take longer to restart, some may take shorter, although in the end, you still get the same thing done. And that's how you restart a Windows 7 computer.